Hi there. Um, I was wondering, is it just me, or are there other people out there that are sad, and their taste buds are a little bad, that Lay's took away um, the crispy taco, um, crispy beef taco, um, potato chip flavor, and the Cheesy garlic bread, bread. Let me say that again. Cheesy garlic bread chip, potato chip flavor. I've been missing them something fierce, and almost to the point of thinking, how do they sleep at night? Taking those things off the shelf and not giving us an opportunity to have such great flavors. For our chip choices. They should be year round. They're year round worthy on the shelf. Worthy. And they were contest winners to boot. That means in addition. Um, so where are they? I want you to bring them back ways. And I've told them already. I wish there was a enough people out there like me that would tell them to please bring them back. I know it's a first order problem. So I shouldn't say things like how do you sleep at night about potato chip flavors. Yes, I realize that. But I want my they're my two favorites of all time in the lace flavor department. And I have other that are really good that I like, but those two of my standout top two favorites. And I want the back. Anybody else? Oh, and also, um, I was really shocked that Lisa, Lisa Marie Presley died. Um, she was only 54. I watched her memorial service um, yesterday online. And um, it was very comforting because there was a lot of gospel music. And it gave me hope that um, she might have gotten saved before she died. So I'm hopeful she's saved and in heaven and to know that also that she um I already knew that she uh got out of Scientology already so a while ago I don't know how long ago so that was great too to, to know that be comforted by that that she got out of there and um, it was a very nice um, memorial service, uh, except for the orange-haired guy. He gave a very nice speech, as did everybody else who gave whom gave speeches. Uh, they all did really well with the speeches or eulogies. Um, but. Or, including the orange-haired guy. But the orange-haired guy, he didn't sing his song very well. It was, like, painful to listen to that one. Plus, I didn't really care for the song. That the, either he had a crew cut or um, he was totally bald. I can't remember. But I didn't like uh, the rendition of his song or how he did it. But other than that, everything else was very, um, very comforting and very, um, uh, it was just, she said to not be sad and to keep it short, and everybody did, and nobody was, um, uh, so it was just 
a very nice one that I she said to not be sad, so I'm not sad about it. I hope she uh, is in heaven, because um, hopefully she got saved before she went. But with all the gospel music, it gives me hope that she she did accept Jesus as her personal savior before going, but it was just a shock that she's gone already at 54. She um, outlasted her dad years-wise by, um, he was 42 when he died, and she made it to 54, and she um, didn't, she, I think she's, if she was on drugs before in her life, she's just not anymore, so. That was something different about her dad. He had drugs in his system, and he also died of a cardiac arrest. And that's what Lisa Marie died of, too, and there were no drugs in her system because she had them. If she ever took them, she doesn't take them now or didn't take them later in life. So that was good, too, that she overcame that. But um, it was very sweet to hear her dad Elvis and her singing together about a um, Christ-centered song. And then again, all the gospel. It was just very, very, um, very, what's the good word? I think I said it at the beginning, so I don't really have to think. Think about it again, because I would be repeating myself. But Okay, my helper is coming later today. It's a little bit after 5 a.m., but I'm not sleepy. I'm a night owl, and then plus I'm not sleepy. I'd be asleep by now, usually. But for some reason, I can't sleep. And it's not for a, any sad reason. Um, it's just, I'm not sleepy. <laughs> so, I got on here to talk with y'all, and wondered how you're doing, and hope you're doing great. Have a great day. Of my hidden treasures, my hidden buried treasures, subbies. Thank you for being there, as always. And I really appreciate each and every one of you. Okay, well, I don't have anything else to say right now. I might get on later, and if I do, there'll be different lighting. And also, just be warned, if I do get on again today, I'll have the same outfit. Freshly changed, and I get a couple of days out of my outfits, or as long as they're not too soiled. Or, um, obviously, I change when I need to change, but I don't get outside of my apartment right now, so I wait a little longer to change from outfit to outfit. So, okay. Bye-bye, everyone.